let's go meet our very first guest for today. Let's do it. So these are your friends, Tenoria. Yes, these are my friends, Sonia and Alex. They are phenomenal recipe developers and cooks, and they have just released their second cookbook. Oh, I love Two that. cookbooks is a big deal, y'all. It really is. <laughs> it's a big deal. You know she has a cookbook, too. Yes. I have zero, so I am going to learn from you guys. <laughs> Thank you for being here. Thank you so, so much for having us. So talk about the new cookbook and what you guys are making today. Sure. So our new cookbook is called A Couple Cooks, 100 Recipes to Cook Together. It's all about celebrating togetherness in the kitchen. Awesome. So maybe you want to cook with your husband. Yeah. Maybe you want to cook with your kids or your family members and so it's just all about the joy of having fun together so good and I'm feeling a lot of joy looking at all of this oh my goodness I don't even know where to start <laughs> yes you know, we have a big fall spread for you today <laughs> yes it's perfect for this time of year so yeah. I see some hearty things start mm -hmm. with this hearty black bean chili yes. it's one of our favorites we started as a campfire recipe where it's so easy to put together you basically dump and stir over the fire yeah. but here we've adapted it for the stovetop Oh, cool. This and smells like really good. Would you like to try good. it? Yes. Oh, are you for kidding it. me? I'd love Go to try it. Right. So a lot of these recipes are ones that we have on our Thank website, you. a acouplecooks.com, and we've kind of retooled them. Other ones are all original. So this one is a, a fan favorite, so we hope you love it. Mmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, the toppings are so good mm -hmm. on it, too. Mm -hmm. And this one is a vegetarian chili, Ooh. so it's a black bean chili. Really? A it's lot so of the good. recipes in the book are vegetarian, mm. but there are recipes for all types of diets. There's chicken, there's meat, um, there's seafood, but it's very a lot of vegetable-forward recipes as well. I love the addition of the corn in here. Me, too. It's hearty. Like, this is filling and good. Mm -hmm. Oh, my goodness, I love it. Tell us about what else you brought. Yeah, so we wanted to have things that would work for any occasion where you would be cooking together. So it's not just for cooking for yourselves, it's cooking for everyone in your family, yeah. your friends. So we have a big pot of chili. We also have this spiced glazed applesauce cake. <gasps> so this one yep. went over so well. We actually had a chef's dinner here in town mm. at Nicole Taylor's Pasta and mm -hmm. she made this from her book and everybody loved it. So it's super easy. I love to make this one with my son. We've made it before. Oh, yes. um, and Thank you. It is just dumpster bake, and then it has Thank a you. sour cream glaze. Yum. Sour cream glaze, yes, okay. With a little bit of cinnamon on top. So this mm. one is so perfect for fall, any fall gathering. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. That is so savory. It's like the perfect fall kind of dessert. Mm -hmm. oh my and goodness. it just keeps hitting me. Like I, I got. Know a bite of something and then later it was like, oh, what's that? Like a little spice. Mm. Yeah, like yes. a little just, oh my goodness. This is just so comforting. Like when you just want to warm up on a day like today, I want to have like a nice little hot cup of tea with this. Yes, that would be lovely. Oh, I love it. Speaking of drinks, what do we got going on over here? Yes, so we also have our cranberry hot toddy. Um, it has a little bit of rum in it, so how do you feel about rum in the morning? I feel okay with rum and I feel good. A little rum sip is okay. Yeah. Oh, rum, sip. rum sip is part of the job. It's yeah. totally okay. <laughs> Especially when people are going to be hosting coming up for the holidays. Mm -hmm. Sometimes oh, you. you want something really special and different. Exactly. So this hot toddy takes the classic rum and water, but we have a little bit of cranberry juice, uh, some fresh orange juice to really brighten it up. Mm -hmm. I'm excited. Mm -hmm. It's going to be our holiday special, I think, Ooh. for all the family. I know, I love the garnish oh, yeah. in there too. Thank now you guys are making Tenori and I laugh because to be totally honest, you told us that you, you lost some of We the did. We uh, had a backstage accident. It's okay. That'll That's happen. Okay. We have that happen. Um, we recovered and we, <laughs> we have, still enough, have some for you. We have so. enough for a sip. We right? have just the right amount, actually. This is perfect for a sip. Yeah, I can't even Cheers, tell you the friend. amount of things that we've spilled on this set. Right. I have no idea. But you yes. just wing it. You just wing it, exactly. Oh my goodness. Mm. Is that like a Ooh. licorice type of like? Yes. The yeah. star anise mm -hmm. in there. You toast it before you add the liquid and it really brings out the flavor. Oh, that is yeah. good. So you're talking about toasting star anise and you all are experts in developing recipes. Tell us a little bit about developing recipes in A Couple Cooks. Sure, so we developed all of these to be really fun occasion recipes for any of life's occasions, be it breakfast, dinner, lunch, entertaining, cocktails. We're very into cocktails on our website, so we have lots of those as well. And um, we are fortunate to have a food blog with millions of readers per month who so cool. are able to test recipes for us. So it's been really cool to be able to have a lot of our readers test these in their kitchen, tell us what they think, 
and we get real-time feedback from home cooks around the country. That is incredible. Well, the feedback today uh, from us is, I love it. <laughs> yum. <laughs> yes, yes. Yum. yum. I love it. That's the Good. feedback. I'm so glad. And we designed this as really as a giftable item. So if you have a holiday gift need, if you have a wedding gift husband need. Husband with a birthday today. A husband yes. with a birthday. Yes. Yes. Perfect. Absolutely. Um, all sorts of occasions, um, we created this book for that. So we love that it's, you know, it's glossy, it's metallic, so it's yeah. heavy, yeah. and it's just a beautiful, giftable item. So you can put it on your coffee table, and that's totally fine, but you can also cook from it. <laughs> yes. I know I love a decorative cookbook in the yeah. kitchen. Yes. So this would be a really yes. good one. Yes. We're excited about how it looks on, a, on the little stand I there, too, so and pretty. even just the spine. Yes. Looks really pretty if you Friends. put it on your shelf. So yeah. you can grab this cookbook at a couplecooks.com. You can get it anywhere cookbooks are sold. Make sure you follow them on Instagram. Their sweet family shows up from time to time. So many recipes on their um, Instagram and their website. I'm so happy for y'all. Yeah, thank, thank you so you. much. Thank thank you. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> this is amazing. Thank you so much. All the information there on the screen. Go follow them for their events coming up as well. Thanks, guys. Thank, thank you. you. Up next, we've got Katie Mann with Indy with Kids. Shares some of her Midwest toys coming to the Chicago Toy and Game Fair next month. <laughs> we'll be Katie. right back. <laughs> we'll see you soon. <laughs>